Hey folks, how you doing? This is Noble Rambler. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 17 and Goldcrest Valley and I think our last episode. At least that's the plan at the moment. Let me hop out of there. Uh, we're going to go and harvest field 5 with three different harvesters. You need to pick up one right now. That didn't work. R. There it is. And... So harvest that field, get the grain hauled away, and that's probably a wrap. Harvesters, we have already got, besides this guy, the case 1660, down here at the end we've got the new Holland CR1090, and we've got the Massey Ferguson Delta 9380. I'm going to pick up the case 2, um, actual flow 9230. So let's grab one of those. Standard crawler track, $22,000 more. Whoa. Uh, front, twin front wheels. I've never seen the twin front wheels. What would you use that for? Is there a space between them so you can straddle rows? Don't need it for what we're doing for wheat. Hmm. Well, we have a crawler track on the new Holland. Let's grab the twin front wheels on this one just so we can see what it looks like. But we're just going to lease it anyway because not really all that necessary all right so we're going to grab you lease it yes and okay and then we're going to grab the header for it that one would be what bet you you're this one yep 9230 so grab you select no choices and lease yes and we're going to grab a trailer let's not forget that header trailers this guy I'm thinking is the longest one and this is a very long header uh, select you color <clears throat> we'll be able to see the yellow that's for sure so lease you yes okay back and that header how long was that that's you right there still right yeah you're 13 meters long you are 13 meters long and you are 12.5 meters long which one did we get we got that one. Okay. Then the Massey Ferguson, there you are, is 12.2. So this, we got these three, I think. Yeah. So th this is the longest one that we've had so far. All right. Back, 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 and back, and jump back into, I guess we're going to jump right into here. Now here's still the tree planter that's been sitting here all this time with the rest of the poplars. I couldn't get unloaded, so I had to get another one just so I could get the... Uh, uh, the tree saplings in. Anyway, let's... That's the front. Alright, let's back this thing up. Oh, there's the twin front wheels. What do you think? That doesn't really go between rows or furrows. What is the point of that? Why... I mean, it spreads you out wider than a single normal wheel, so I guess it spreads the weight out more, but I uh, don't know what that what that would straddle if that is in fact the reason why okay I'm aiming for what right over there something like that and we're pretty much there that'll do boy that's big oh look at the the weight dropping down oh you've got your own toe will you look at that I didn't need that uh, that trailer okay can I... Well, I'm kind of trapped here, aren't I? Let's, um... Let's see. X? No, not X. Let's GX. Alright, put that in. I'll swing out over here. And actually more like this. Put you back down again. X that again. Put the wheels down. And then... V and Q. Okay. Well, we don't need that trailer. I guess we'll just leave it there and you know, donate it to someone. <laughs> All right, let's hook this up. I've got the other harvesters already out of the field, so I don't have to worry about all the transport time of hauling everything in. Where are you at? You're pretty close. Rear wheel steering and Q. All right, so here's the case, the big case, the 9230, the big wheels. This looks good. I'll open it up when we're over there and see how it all unfolds. Best way in. We're actually going all the way down the highway to the very last road. So I guess we'll just take the main road here. Don't have to worry about winding back through 
In fact, we'll, uh, we'll just wind around this way. We'll take the whole road. Come out here a little bit. Oh, a lot of header. There it is. Slow down. Yep. Brake lights in the back. There we go. Nope. It's not clear. Take that sign out, too. Boy, that's a lot of tail swing. All right, let's get out on the main road. Can't hurt as many people out there. Road's clear. Road's clear. Let's go for it. We are as wide as the lane. Yep. All right. Going 16. Can't break the speed limit in this town, that's for sure. On this thing. Kind of looking everything over. Where are my wheels at? Probably over there. Got mirrors? Yeah, I'm barely within the lines there. I can't tell where I'm at there. Probably across the yellow line. Oh, there's the yellow line. Yeah, we can go all the way over here. Okay. Anyways, up above. Yeah, checking it all out. We can see back inside. And keep your eyes on the road. Alright. Yeah, I probably should be over in the other lane, but um, there's poles on the side of the road over there. Now, that's our road there, so we're not taking that one. We want to go to the next one. Anybody stacked up behind us? Not that I can tell. I seem to still be in my lane. Okay. <laughs> there's the yellow line. And no, I don't see anybody behind, but I feel like I want to scrunch down a little bit so I can see a little bit higher back there. Someone uh, adjust that mirror for me. Just, you know, lift it up a little. All right, let's make a turn right here. Oh, there they are. They did go around me. Okay. Head in like so. Don't jackknife the header against the back bumper. Okay. Now, this road does have cross traffic, and I am quite wide, aren't I? Yeah, not bad. If I touch the dirt when there aren't signposts, then I should be okay. So, what episode is this? I think something like 79? Yeah, this, this has been a long run. Considering a lot of these were 40, to, 40 minutes to an hour. There's a lot of time in this series. This is a fun game. I mean, it could go on indefinitely. There's, you'll never get, you know, run out of things to do. But I think we have done just about everything so far. Except for, well, we've even harvested Field 5 once. But as a contract job. And that was, that was too much. <laughs> but I won't have to do the harvesting this time. Let, uh, we'll hire all that out. and I'll just transport the, uh, the grain. All right. I'm going to tighten up this roadway here a little bit. No cross traffic. Good. Or oncoming traffic. Now, I brought over some of the equipment already. I brought over the harvesters and the headers. I brought... Uh, Two tractors with trailers attached, or tippers attached, and I even got the uh, the cultivator over there to start pulling in behind us. Mm, I'm gonna pull into our grassed out end of the field over here, so I can kind of line up a little better. So we need to dump off this header. In fact, let's kind of dump it off right here. And was it this side? Of course not. Or was? It was. Okay. Right there. Right like that. Hook you up and... Let's see. G, X. I should pull all the wheels in. There they go. And all that weight. Yeah. Now, if I remember right, it's... Do this. I'm like, Oh, wow. I didn't know I had a depth as well. I have an up and down and a depth. What's that look like outside? Yeah. Fancy stuff. I guess you would adjust it to the crop that you're that you're doing. Whips it in there. When would you pull it all the way in and all the way down? Looks like it's almost scraping metal there. Hmm. Don't know. Again, not necessary for the game. It's just uh, just for role play, basically. The the crop is more like a, a yes or no. It's it doesn't know if you if you've set that correct or not. Let's 
make sure I've got turnaround room. It's going to be a little challenging for this big rigs. Uh, taking all the trees out. Let's see what they do. Yeah, let's line up this one. Now I've got... I'll show you the plan here in a moment. Something like that. We've got... Our... Oops. The other way. Our Massey Ferguson's over there. Let's pop out of here and run over. Because I don't know how many tabs and or shift tabs to get me to each of these. I'll have to run the... Uh, the whole uh, arsenal of equipment. So I ran the Massey Ferguson through here and basically split. Actually, oops, hit the wrong button there. You go away. Let's go to nine. There we go. Nope, I can't use my mouse on nine. Okay, let's go back to here. All right, it doesn't show it. Oh, if I do it this way, there. So I hit, well, made a guess of what was close to a third. I see I'm a little bit long. But the harvester we just brought in has got the biggest header so I'm guessing he needs the biggest third so that should be just fine. Massey Ferguson's got the smallest header. He's going to start here and the New Holland's going to start up in here. we got to get that set up. Then we'll turn him on, run down, turn him on, run down, turn him on and then um, get the, uh, uh, the the tractors ready to go to go and pick up the grains and, and then somewhere in the middle we'll get the cultivator going and get him going back and forth. So pop out of view, run all the way up here. Ran that in record time. All right, there's that header, and here he is with the tracks. <laughs> Oops, I'm still hooked up. Okay, um, G, Q. Actually, that was kind of fun from NCAV. We'll do that again. Where are you? There you are. Uh, I'm a little long on that turn. Hmm. Let's get at least a little bit closer. Or, you know, a little bit. That'll work. Okay. Then I want to G and X, and that pulls in the wheels on this guy. There they are. And you can see the whole thing lean down. Now, to line him up properly, I've really got to be out here. Otherwise, just doing some guessing. That's sweet over there, too, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know if we should quickly buy that, that field. We don't own that field, do we? Where is that field? No, that's field four. Yeah, we bought three. We thought about buying four. Hmm. <laughs> we'll see. I think while we're here, maybe we'll just... Do that one too. Anyway, let's hire you out. He opens up. Drops in. There he goes. All right. Up out of you. Run all the way back over here. And jump into this one. Up the ladder. All right. Fire you up. And hire you out. Jump out of you. We can run over and run all the way down here. And jump up this ladder. <laughs> Fire you up, X. That's the wrong X. X again, G and X. There we go. And hire you out. There you go. And I was going to say we could ride in this for a while, except that I'll have to get all the way back. Back. Yeah, let's ride in this for a while. Uh, jump inside. Time we get all the way back, this still will only have maybe, I don't know, 15, 20% at the most filled. It's going to take, you know, they're going to, they're going to be hoppers back here. We should get a two or three runs of this field. So there's the other one over there. Yellow. Where is big yellow? It's going to be up in that corner somewhere. Where is the corner? I think it's actually to the left of the White Mountain Peak. I mean, that field goes for a long, long time. Hmm. Yep, I think we have curvature of the earth there. We still... It, it's so far away we can't see where yellow is. Of course, he's probably right over there. You know what? <laughs> uh, we can cheat and get up in the air. The drone view. Still can't see it. Yeah, but oh, there he is. 
I think he's just turned around. Yeah, right behind second red over there. I see a yellow something, but I don't see it moving yet. Oh, he's navigating trees over there. Can I get over there? What's it take to go all the way to there? Yellow, where are you? There you are. So you... We're doing a lot of turning and what have you. This guy, let's see what he does when he turns. There's yellow. I know he's New Holland, but I'm going to call him yellow. And red... One and red two. That's what we'll do. Now he's backing all the way up over here. Oh, he backed up to dump the rest of the chaff. And chaff? I didn't think about that. Or straw, or whatever you want to call it. Well, that's an interesting backing up. Turning around uh, technique. I haven't seen that one before. That feels new. Like that's... They've done... The last couple of updates have... Uh, have done a lot to the AI and trying to get him to work properly in the fields. Um, let's continue tabbing over to our new one. There you are. What are you going to do? Are you going to do the same thing? No, you're going to do it the traditional way. So I guess it depends on how much room's in front of him. Yeah, that's the way I'm used to. It's a hard 180 and... Okay. You got this, right? There you go. Alright, um... Now you're at 36%. Okay, so we're going to get three passes. I should probably be dumping one of these down about now. or In order to get back to the... The, you know, the furthest one before he's ready. But my tractor is, you know... Two miles in front of us. Just see that little tiny thing over there. I'm not going to run that. So, we're going to take a ride. There's a red 2 over there. And yellow is beyond the curvature of the earth. Yep. <laughs> now, play in this game when you're not narrating it. You just sit back and drive the equipment. It's a very different experience. It's been interesting creating this for YouTube. But it's, it's nothing like actually playing the game. At least that's what I've discovered. So when you narrate and you're thinking about what to say and your brain's in a different mode. So you're not in sit back and enjoy mode. You're in work mode. So it'd be kind of nice to get back into this game just for myself for a while and, and enjoy it. I don't think I'm going to be bringing the uh, the Platinum Edition to this to the, the channel. You know, the... Uh, the, the map from South America. I think I'm just going to sit back and enjoy the game myself for a while and concentrate on other things. I've got uh, RimWorld's going to be coming out with their Alpha 18 soon, and I want to make a, a series for that. In fact, um, the uh, patrons over on my Patreon will be the ones that are actually doing the crash landing, so I'll I'll create a scenario involving them dropping in, and then after that's done, any subscribers that want to jump in, just let me know in the comments, and I'll work you in. You'll be a, you know, a prisoner that we will have uh, convinced to join us or something like that at some, you know, some other time, and we'll see if we can get maybe a couple of colonies going and just have fun with that, but that's going to take up a lot of time, so I don't see being able to to uh, continue with, with this series then. I didn't know for sure what the timing would be, but Alpha 18's already in, in testing. Hello! Boy, that would have been a trip to the hospital. <laughs> didn't think he was going to back up on me. <laughs> anyway, we've got weed in here. So, if you are interested in becoming a patron in time before uh, RimWorld 18 does come out officially and, and I begin recording it, then you can be one of the uh, crash survivors. Otherwise, now you're going to turn that way and I can't get into you. What have we got going on the other ones? Um, you know, there'd be a, something at the top, well, if you're on a computer, I don't know what it is for our phones, but, uh, green tank is full, yeah. All of these have got their tubes off to the right. All of them do. I can't get to a single one. Well, we'll just have to do this the hard way. Anyway, um, the little information button in the top corner of the screen will take you to more information on that, if you, uh, if you are curious. He, oh, he's going this direction. I can't get to him, at least. Okay. Well, let's race up here. 
Get there before he gets to the end so he won't make the turn. Pull out here so you guys can hear me. Where is that tube going to get? Am I outside of the header? I think I am. Right in there. Boy, got here just in time. Alright, dump you down. You stay right there. Oh, look at the... <laughs> just looking at the header and all the last of the material just made it into the center. Now, what am I going to get out of this guy? He was full, too. A has, has filled up. A, I don't know who... Well, I'm guessing this was D. So we have A somewhere. To find out. Of course, by the time we get there, they'll all be full. So we're going to dump off at the mill right over there. Right in front of Red 2. And sell it there. Um, no, you're done. Okay, pull off before you do something crazy there. Oh, I got you. I bumped you. Let's see if you can correct after that. And actually, I want to go back the other way. I'm going to spin around over here and really mess up his day. Yep. Come get me. Woohoo! <laughs> and B is full. So B's over there. A's in the middle. Okay, now where are you going? You're turning out just right so I can get to you. So let's wait for you. And I got 38% out of that. So that's pretty good. Looks like uh, one full hopper out of all of them will fill this guy up. Alright, give, uh, give me a tube. There we are. And we're going to have to do you while we're driving, aren't we? Yeah. I tuck in nice and close. And I see cruise controls at 6, so 3. And that sets us. Now stay away from that header. That header's pretty close. Let's speed up a little bit, and then 3. Okay. Get out of the header. A is blocked by an object. You are A. Now 1. And slow it down a little bit. And then 3. Block the end there. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Then let's floor it. And three. That was really weird. Oh, not three. One and two. That's what I needed. Okay, so two again. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. So we're in the 60s. And I think we're getting low on this, this brain tank here. I'm going to stay up here so it's not too noisy. So everybody is dumping except for him. He didn't get set to dump the, uh, the straw behind are you done? You're done. Okay, let's get out of here. Hmm. So we're going to have to dump you in the field, or in, in the wheat. No choice about that. So we're going to have two-thirds of this place ready for bailing. Well, I will at least. I don't think I'll be recording that one. So we're going to pull right in through here and just pretend we're not destroying perfectly good mature wheat. Yeah. Right in like that. And then maybe I'll grab the other tractor with the two tippers and go back and get yellow one more time. How much you got? You got a big... Oh, you're the big one. Yeah, we're not going to... Uh, that guy to come back just to get you. Yeah, we're only going to take you down halfway. I don't know what the capacity was. Dare I look? Uh, not that way. Yeah, I'm about full. Let's just say it's a lot. There we go. Alright, let's dump you off. Oh, this is going so slow. I'm floored right now. Alright, we got to jump this somewhere. Should feel a lot of bump, bump, bump doing that. Yeah. Boom, boom. All right. Pull you into here. Kill it. Pull out. Jump in. And the greenery's over there. So let's remember to park these things more toward the other end there. All right. Um, actually, you're good. So let's go this way.
All right, now where? Now your tube's on the wrong side. Where's yellow? Yeah, your tube's in the in the grain, in the wheat. Yellow is up there. He's facing what direction right now? I think he's going away to. No, you're on the correct side. So can I get there? Where am I? Who am I? I'm warrior, aren't I? No, I'm in the uh, Voltra. Okay. Hop out here. And your cruise is set for six as well. And three. Not enough. Pull in. Not enough. Right there. There we go. So. One. One. Two, two. There, locked him in. And he should have only had about a half a tank, which is all one of these little guys are going to hold. Let's see, we're, we're, we're straying here. We're drifting. So there we go. Pull back to there. So we'll give him one trailer, one tipper. And then, oh, you're done. Okay, floor it. Get out there ahead of him. And cut him off. All right. Red one is just coming up here, and we'll dump him off. We'll take this in and, I guess, dump it directly, because we're now out of empty tippers. He's probably going to have a problem with me. Uh, hmm. Just wonder if I should toggle over to... Uh, wait a minute here. This is Warrior. That's the Warrior. Yeah, Vulture is over there with the IT runner. Okay. Or if I should toggle out to the warrior and get him dumping. And get back over here, but... Nah, we'll let him make his turn. I think uh, Red 2 is just going to have to be stalled over there for a while. Because these guys take forever to make their turns. <laughs> what is this three-point backing up stuff? Just make a Yui and get her done. All right. Let's trigger that tube. Here you are. Something like... Well, oh, you got a shorter tube. We got to be really tight. Right there. And one, one. And two, two. All right, these will hold 21. Yeah, 21 in each of these. So we actually have more capacity here than I was thinking. Okay, a couple of twos. And a couple of ones. And you're done. Wow. Although I can't get to the other one anyway. But I can get... I can get the other tractor dumped. I think so. Oh, I am almost tempted to go get the Baylor. That's why I said I wasn't absolutely certain if this was the last episode. I thought I'd just kind of play it by ear. I hadn't thought about all the straw that would be left. But, I mean, officially the field's not done until the field's done. <laughs> Some of you are saying, yeah, let's get another one of this thing. Oh, will you please end this thing? All right, let's, let's get this dumped. And I want to make sure that we're dumping out the back end and not the, let's see here, G, yeah, not the, not the green gate. Okay, there. Let's go dump this. Then we'll come back and dump everybody with this one. And then we'll use the, uh, the warrior and the two tippers as the backup one this thing fills. We just kind of keep that routine going. We're going to start getting warnings here before long. This is going to take a long time to dump. Hopefully this thing fits in there. I don't think I've had the IT runner in this narrow little space. It's like driving European trucker on those tiny little European roads. All right, right there, and I got it. If I go forward a little, you aren't going to hit the ceiling, are you? stop now. You can stop. Okay. Floor it. 
what did we get there? Twenty-seven thousand dollars. Good, and we paid twelve hundred for wages. All right, where to? Top end. You're turning the correct direction. I can dump you out now. Okay. Then we get back to yellow and we get to red one. times two times there we go what have you got in that tank over there maybe halfway maybe actually this field's almost done I've never I've never done this field with three before there was the one field the, the big field and uh Whoa, what was the name of it? I've lost the name of the map now. The map that was, uh, that was the, you know, the, the map for Farming Simulator 2013. And then they went into 15 with it also. Westbridge Hills. The big one in the bottom right corner. I did have two or three harvesters running in that one. I was doing this sort of thing. That was a lot of fun. Now, i got to watch that. I forget that they keep, the graphic shows that it's flowing steadily even though it's not really registering steadily down there so there's no visual that they've emptied that they're just uh, dumping it in as they're producing it okay you are up there going the wrong direction oh we have a we have a conflict coming up here yep heck we do let's do something here if I can let's go ahead and buy this field and we'll turn one of those guys loose in there Okay, you, you can stop. Thank you. Boy, I thought he was going to drive over this. You want $225,000 for your... Yeah, okay, sure. Bye. There we go. We've got another field. Just something fun for this last episode. Let's go back and dump whichever harvester is not going to be aimed the wrong direction when they both come to a, a sudden impact up here. You're in there... Okay, I see what's happening. They did manage to somehow turn around each other. How did they... Oh, okay. Hey, look at that. They're, they're playing nice. I've never had that happen before. Anytime you get a situation like this, they go head-to-head -head and, and play duel. Wow. It's kind of nice to see your tractors getting along. Alright, sneak in here behind, get him emptied. Emptied enough. Uh, this one I really gotta get in close. When I get to where I can see it, it gets noisy. Okay, something like that. And, yeah, getting close. He's still dumping. I'm getting really close. Mm. Alright, we'll pull out. What are you doing? Oh, that's me. That's me. Right there. Come on. Alright, let's try this again. Just like that. Yeah, there's a real tiny gap there. Oh, you're done. Okay. Let's go get yellow. Who's... Okay, now we're not going to get along anymore. <laughs> Let's go turn yellow loose into the other field. That'll stop you. Okay. Unhire. 
Actually, a little further. You can have a blast right over here. Um, you know, let's take you this way. You are full, though. Alright, something like that. Let's get a little bit closer and higher. Jump out. Grab this guy before he gets... Whoa, you look at that. He's going to pop right in there and... Oh, go forward. Oh, just missed it. Will you dump anyway? You will. Thank you. Um, really? That's it? Oh, that was a little disappointing. Okay, let's get you dumped. And let's take a look at the other end of this field and see if you're able to even handle this. Okay, now you have got more room. It'll be out here. Yeah, something like that. Alright. One in manual here. No cruise control. And we'll stop a little bit shy so you can get out to the front of the trailer there. Stop. Thank you. Dump you down. Actually, this went a whole lot faster than I thought. Then I've never had harvesters this big before. You know, when I was playing Westbridge Hills, I was playing entirely with the money that I made. So I wasn't buying the, the giant equipment. I was, you know, wash, rinse, and repeat with the small ones to make enough money to, to, to expand. So this is a luxury here compared to the way I normally play the game. Now you look like you're done. All right, let's go find Red 2. We'll take the road. Red 2 should be just about done. He had the bigger third, but he's got... No, he's got some more to go. Okay. Okay, let's jump through the trees here. And you are where? You're on this side, and you're in the right direction. And I've still got 24% of my capacity left. I wonder if that's enough. Well, between this and the other guys, it should be enough to get this going. Your beacons on? Do you have beacons? I'm not seeing beacons on this guy. He's got to be 80%. Oh, there's beacons there. They're just not flashing. Okay. Now, you have got to be actually in the, uh, the straw path. All right. Three. See the grain over there dumping into the uh, harvester like a big fountain. Fill pipe right there. Oh, yellow is doing that field. That means we're not going to have any uh, bailing there. Oh well, that'll be fine. Yeah. I believe it, there's enough bailing here to uh, drive us nuts. Bailing you've got to do manually. I don't believe you can hire it out. Which means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 10... 10 to 15 10 mile runs. That's going to be a while. Alright, you're done. I'm about done. So he can make that final rope. I can go sell this off. And then we'll race up there and, and empty yellow. There we go. Much quieter in cab. Now, what's it like to navigate this room in here? There it is. It is a little more difficult. Kind of hard to tell how those fenders push out. And can I... I, I hit. Yeah, I can't... I can't see in that mirror where there is a post hitting that trailer. I would never be able to, to know by looking at these mirrors that I hit. Interesting. What's happened here? I didn't. I'm in the air. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Ah, we need some momentum. That's what we need. Yeah, floor it. Aha. Uh -huh. That's what it was. All right, you're still chosen. You are I. Watch that ceiling. Let's back up. Let's forward to about there. Yep, back up a little. There you are. Oh, 
Oh, the, I was gonna say the money's dropping that hard, but I just realized I leased a bunch of equipment. That's what it is. And we're certainly not getting the best price for wheat right now. Yeah, I gotta think about that. Where normally you would save it and then sell it at a uh, great demand, or or uh, where am I going? I'm going up this way, or uh, just anywhere that the price is good, which is wheat right there. Price isn't good anywhere. No greens. And we are dumping at this one. So if we had seen this at the very beginning, it may have been 700 and something, it'd be dropping each load we dump in because there's less demand for it in that place now. So you do want to spread your, your stuff out if you can. Have everybody's high price that's, that's up there near the top. But it'll be fine. Let's... Tell you what, let's just catch you right here. Let's see if I can get you to put your tube out. Before you unhire. Perfect. That'll do. Alright, B's done, A's done, and we just have D over there. Who's on his second or third pass? He's gonna be filling up. You done? You're done. Okay. empty him out and yeah I will do one more episode to clean up all of this we'll get the uh, we'll get the, the cultivator going in the corner over there should we get the plow going we could put the plow on, on this guy on, on Voltra and get the I see with the Massey Ferguson's down there with the uh, with the cultivator he's got the weight in the front and We'll try to race the two of them and get all of the uh, the hay bailed up before they catch us. Maybe that'd be a fun thing to do. Where are you? You're over there and you're going the wrong direction. Yeah. Uh, any beacons? What are you doing? You're just getting started. And I don't get the sense that you're in panic mode. You can run me over this time, right? Uh, you're only 47%. No, no problem catch you at the other end. In fact, while we're waiting, let's... Where am I? I want to go back like three or four. There you are. Fire you up, get you over there, and you can start cleaning up that field. That one's not going to be uh, bailed. Let me get that one cleaned up. I'm ready for my uh, retirement from the series where I can sit back and relax and not have to think about what I'm going to do next. Narrate. <laughs> X. Right there and Hire you. No, that one. Oh, turn you on anyway. What are you doing? Oh, so you ignore the lights. Okay. Let me out. And let's go. That's helper J. D is in there. Let's jump in here and get him emptied. And floor it. Yeah, I think this was the best direction to do this. The, uh, let's see here. Three. The rocks over there would have been pretty difficult. Okay, turn you out a little bit. And stop. Stop. Thank you. Yeah. Now the rocks over there, especially right in the middle, probably would have freaked it out. Though I think the AI can handle that now. I think you could have pulled it off. But I would have spent a lot of time maneuvering things. So I think that's probably the best way. Oh, you're done? Okay. So now what? He could probably handle the rest of the field with that hopper. So let's race back over. And what? 
Now you're clear to make your turns there, right? No, you're not. You can't handle it. Okay. Okay, you finished that. Uh, tube back in. And who are you? Massey Ferguson. Your trailer is down here. We'll go set you on there. And he's at the other end. Okay. We'll toggle over and get him ready to go back home. So some of the stuff is just going to go uh, right back to the store and be unleashed. A lot of these things I just got for one or two episodes that we were doing something. Because it was going to take so long to actually earn enough money to be able to finish the series. Alright, you're going to go something like that. Right there. Now, am I aligned right? Actually looks pretty good. Okay. So a little further. Get you pretty much centered. Um, I see. That bar right there sits in that. So if I hit V. Didn't work. G, V. No, I missed you. Pull you back up. Okay, so not quite aligned. You need to go forward and turn hard. Right there, now V. I have a feeling when I hit Q, let's see, V again, you're just going to auto-align. Oops. There's a lot of momentum. Okay. There's no brakes. There. You happy there? Let's see what happens. Q. Not good. Q. <laughs> All right, let's get you back over there. And V, 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 V. Oh, you reset when I put you back on again. All right, now Q. Well, I think you like that. I don't know if I like that, but. All right, something like that. Anyway, can you just stay here? Well, let's hook you up. Probably should have pulled that uh, this, this beater down, this bar, and, and uh, what you, rotator, what do you want to call that? And got the center of gravity down there a little bit. I want to go forward, not back. Where am I? Okay. There, and Q. Okay. Turn you off, and let's just tab over till we find something. You're probably a good find. Yeah. Should we go dump him again? Now nah, he doesn't need it. Let's let's keep tabbing until we find something that looks right. There you are. Dumping off the last year load. Turn you on. And O brings in the tube. And this guy's got some speed to him. No, he doesn't. He, he's just got some, a real fast takeoff. But he still limits to 16. Okay. So we'll bring him up behind red one. And drop off his header and get him hooked up. And eventually we'll get back to the warrior and get him dumped off. By then, yellow will be done and ready to go. Oh, let's see. Actually, I want to be off in that direction. We'll just do the thump thump for a while. Well, that ladder hangs down awfully low. Now, what is the point of the twin front tires? What do you think? Does it just spread out the weight better? Or is he meant to drop into furrows? I can't think of any furrows that would... Well, okay. He... Whoa, we're here. He doesn't do just wheat. So there'll be multiple headers that will go on this. So I guess there'll be other uses for him. Anyway, um, what is selected? G and V and X. That's not an X. How about that one? All right, you there, and Q. Okay, and X. That's what I missed on the other one. I didn't fold up the Massey Ferguson. We got to do that before we take off, too. The two is sticking out there too long. Like so, and... Where is... Is that really the hookup right there? It is, okay. You're done. Let's go fold this guy up. Got to get this episode ended. Try to keep it under an hour. And... X. 
No, let's try G then X. There you go. Oh, you're happy now. Okay. So, tab until we find, not him, but, but, him. All right, let's get him dumped off. There. I want, not green door. You. I want back. And then, G. And then, you. Back. All right. And then, F. One. I'm going to have to cut across the field here, because I need to be over here. And this time I'm going to stay outside so I can see what I'm doing. Not that that's going to help any. Coming in fast. Alright. Now the one that's in there, I can just hit I and it won't matter which I'm selected to because it doesn't care. It's one of that last time. Alright, dump you in there. Boy, it'd be nice to get enough out of this whole experience to pay for that equipment. But making a profit wasn't the goal this time. The goal was just the fun of tackling the biggest field on the map just once. All right, get you dumped off, and then we're heading to where? Heading back to the... Um, lost the name, the Voltra. So you're ready to head home now. And so that's probably like five tabs. Yep. All right. Off to yellow. And your tube's in the right direction. Good. But the helper system in this game sure makes the game fun. The helpers with an AI capable of handling anything but a plow. That's pretty much it, too. It can handle most anything else. It just cannot handle the plow. But I'm really hoping that that's going to clear up. I wonder if the Platinum Edition is going to add some more uh, scripting to the game and be able to, to repair the, the plow problem. If that happens, then this game is pretty much grown up. Pretty much all the bugs have finally been worked out. There's the potato shed over there and all the potatoes spilling out the front. There was a lot of potatoes in that field. Alright, I'm thinking... Two more passes? Probably so. You're about there now. Okay. Oh, you got me. You can handle anything but plows and backing up against another trailer. And you've got a fence over there. You gonna be able to pull that off? I gotta get a crunch here. Slow down. You just gonna keep going until you hit. No, oh, you made it. Okay. <laughs> So, I guess I'm needed on that back wall right now. Go over there and look at the potatoes. Yeah, he's got a pass and a half left. After this one, so two and a half left. There it is. I'm just coasting. All that weight's just keeping me rolling forward. What's the green light down here? Those are all the hydraulic levers down underneath the green. And what's over on top of there? Are those gauges? Hmm. What are those? I see these jacks down here. Two in the front. Are there any others? No. It's one of those are four levers for the four jacks. And all the little levers there. I think those top ones are gauges. And down there, more levers for lifting and, and all the operation of the, the equipment there. Oops, let me turn you off. But I think by now we ought to be ready to empty out this guy. And your last pass yet? What's it look like? Oh, he's got just a sliver left. Is that what I'm seeing? Yep, just a sliver. Darn. <laughs> I wonder if the AI will consider this done. I wonder if it can 
perceive that that counts. It'll be interesting to watch, as well as what you're going to do to this fence. Let's watch this turn around. Just watching the cultivator back there. He seems to be going the wrong direction. I see. He's in the middle of a turnaround. Okay, there you go. Alright, what are you going to do here? You're going to do that. You're going to go on the outside. You're going to hit that rock at the end. Nah, I guess you got room. Okay. Although I don't have room, do I? Let's find out. Yeah, it's going to be a little tight right there. Yeah, we got it. There it is. Alright, your bin is almost empty. Yeah, it is empty now. Oh, now it's giving me spurts. I wasn't doing that before, but then it's only one little you know, row wide right now, so that's why. There are a lot of invisible bumps on this road. Yeah. Anyway, you're done? You're done. And we're done. So... Yeah, we're going to, I'll sneak in one more episode of, of Bailing over there. I think it'd be worth it. This has been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.